Merry Christmas everyone, my name is Comet and today I have for you something very special coming into the channel and I am talking about Pokemon Scarlet, the Teal Mask DLC. Today we are going to start the adventure and for this reason, thank you everyone for joining me. Let's begin! Now for those of you new to the channel and new to Pokemon, the Teal Mask is a DLC for Pokemon Scarlet. On the main story of Pokemon Scarlet, you are a student that um, enrolls in different activities on your academy. And as you get better, as you get stronger, you become the best student of the academy. To a point where now, now that you are the star of the academy, um, there is someone who wants your help. But let's get more information by joining um, the Academy Hall just in front of us and let's see what they have um, to tell us. Because someone has requested us specifically, so let's see what they want. Here we are, and it seems like it's this person. Look at this. The entrance is amazing. I, 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 I love the entrance of the academy. But let's see, this is the person. Mr. Jack, which is a professor, said the students for the school trip will be around here. Hmm, are you... <gasps> you must be! You're one of the students chosen for the school trip, aren't you? And your name was... Comet! Comet, huh? Well, aren't you full of fire? Yes, I am. You're positively dazzling. <laughs> oh, and you even have a Terra Orb. I guess Paldea is rich enough in resources for that sort of things to be common sight at school. Unless that's not the case, are you perhaps an, ex a a an especially exceptional student? Oh, but here I go on and on. I haven't even introduced myself. Call me... Miss Briar. I'm sorry, I'm late. That's Jack the professor who um, had contacted us earlier to say that um, they wanted my help for something. And apparently we're gonna do a school trip. So let's see what's everything about. Oh, hello to you too, Comet. What a lucky scamp you are, getting to take part in a school trip so soon after transferring here. I sure am happy for you. I wish I could go as well. Um. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Pryor. I got a bit carried away. Well, as, Miss, as Mr. Jack so kindly stated for me, my name is Briar. I'm a teacher over at Blueberry Academy. That's a school in the Unova region. Unova! Wait. Unova region is the fifth generation. Would this be probably a call out to that? That's a school in the Unova region, you know? Mrs. Briar helps set the curriculum out there. This year is Blueberry's Academy's turn to run our joint school trip and supervise the students. That's why I came here to collect you. We'll be heading to Kitakami, a land known for its pintoresque fields and rice paddies. The place has a rustic feel, but there's also something rather mysterious about it. You see, the same energy present in Paldea's terrestrial phenomenon has been detected there. I'm hoping to do some digging into the matter myself in between my supervising duties. Though I'd also appreciate the chance to take a good look around the Paldea crater, sorry, around the great crater of Paldea. Ah yes, well there's not much I can do about that without permission from the Pokemon League and Director Clavel. Oh, I know. I've already put it 
all the proper applications. I trust that I'll get a favorable, a favorable response soon. Hmm, well, hmm. <gasps> I know. Oh, sorry, Comet. Forgot all about you for a moment there. Anyway, the school trip think... Uh, anyway, the school trip. Think of it as a chance to continue your treasure hunt on a grander scale. Um, now, as your main goal as a student here in the um, academy, they gave you a project that was to find your own treasure. What does this mean? It means that what is important for you in life, right? And for this, on the normal story mode, we had three different um, stories that we had to explore. We had the stories um, for the Titan Raids where we help someone get um, some special herbs to heal his Pokemon that was wounded. Um, another story was the traditional Pokemon League where you follow the story of you becoming um, a, a champion. And finally, the third story is the story of a group of people that are causing trouble around the um, the academy and it's your job to see what's going on over there. And after all of this, you make a lot of friends and you go into the great crater of Paldea, which is the area zero. And then you discover, you know, that you really like just spending time with friends and they, that they were valuable to you, but that's just part of this, the treasure hunt. It's, it hasn't finished yet. So we need to continue looking for what's important for us on Kitakami. That way, you'll be able to continue your treasure hunt on a grander scale, to search beyond Paldea's borders. I'll even provide you with a special update to your Pokédex app. If you'd get out your phone, which is the Rotom Dex right there. The Kitakami Pokedex has been added to your Pokedex app. This is perfect because now we're going to be able to capture and record on the Pokedex all of the um, Pokemon that we can find on Kitakami. And there we go. All done. Now you can go wild registering all of the Pokemons you find around Kitakami 2, which is what I was mentioning. That's all good. Oh, and do not worry about the permission um, slip for the trip. I already cleared things with your mom. Oh, that's nice. You just go and have fun. Oh, I'm so excited, man. <laughs> I'm so excited. Ah, you, Mr. Jack. Is quite charming, isn't he? The light will direct when he wants to be. Now then, Comet, it's quite a trip to the land of Kitakami. I hope you don't mind flying or long bus rides. Let me know as soon as you're ready to set out, won't you? Oh, I'm ready. Now, um, I do want to mention something, and that is the um, Pokemon team that I'm gonna bring to Kitakami. And I found a very interesting idea, which is playing Kitakami, or playing on the Teal Mask DLC, with only the Pokemons that we can find over there. Obviously, at the beginning, we cannot do that. Uh, so, I'm just gonna uh, take Koraidon for that. But once I start capturing more Pokemons, we can focus on the Pokemons that we have on Kitakami, uh, over Kitakami. That way, we can complete a nice Pokedex and have fun, you know, with the new Pokemons. Uh, let's see, I am ready. Are you ready to set out for Kitakami Comet? Yes, let's go, baby! Great! Uh, wait, give me a moment, I wanna get my pocket extra over here. Great, we we'll set out together as a group once the other students have arrived. I hear you were all chosen for this trip by lottery, so this may be the first time you meet. Interesting. I know my role is to chaperone you kids around, but I fully intend to have some fun of my own. While at it, 
just so you're aware. <laughs> By the way, do you know of the Scarlet Book? Ooh, I do know. As you should, it was the most influential book of the century on the subject of the paranormal. The author of the Scarlet Book, Heath, was in fact an ancestor of mine. Ooh. I even have his original manuscript. Look here, these are the pages that were blacked out and made illegible in the published version of the book. A disc Pokemon. Oh shoot! This is a uh, this is a preparation for the Indigo disc as well. While separated from the research team in the crater's depth, I found a strange entity. Whether it was a Pokemon or even alive at all, I know not. It bore a shell with layers of overlapping hexagons and gleamed brighter steel than, gems than gemstones. Viewed as a whole, it resembled a mysterious, brilliant disc. I have tentatively named this creature Terrapagos. I suspect that its very body is made up of the key material that causes Pokemon to shine brightly and crystallize. So this is like the main source of the ter um, terrestrialized phenomenon, which is um, your Pokemon crystallizing and gaining a new... Um, a new type. The Pokemon depicted on these pages is called Terrapagus. It's a mysterious Pokemon that Heath allegedly encountered when he delved even further into the depth of Area Zero. Not that the general public believed him. It's my dream to find Terrapagus and prove that Heath's records were all true. Though I haven't yet been able to secure permission to enter Area Zero, unfortunately. Well, guess who goes around in Area Zero 24-7? Moi. But that's fine. It'll all be fine. All I need to do is now focus on the work that is in front of me while we wait. Mrs. Briar, we're ready to go. Some random students that I've never seen before. <laughs> Looks like the gangs are here. All right, everyone, to the land, go, to the land of Kitakami. Let's go, baby. <gasps> That's a plane. Look. That's oh, look at that, a Dragonite. It's the first time I see that. That's so cool. And Dragonite, obviously, supersonic Pokemon. <laughs> look at this. The hidden treasures of Area Zero. Whoa! I'm, I'm screenshotting that. <laughs> the teal mask. Oh, baby. I am so excited for this. We're finally here. My butt is killing me after all those hours sitting. First the plane, then the boss. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> well, you all survived the long trip. And we haven't lost anyone along the way. All here. Then welcome to the land of Kitakami. This is the stage for all the new experiences and learning opportunities you'll have out in nature. <sighs> It's actually my first time here too. Why? The rice fields are really just dazzling. Man, the, uh, this is so good. This is like the countryside of Japan. It, uh, I love it, man. This reminds me a lot, especially of Inuyasha. If you guys watch anime, you know what I'm talking about. Inuyasha and the rice fields are, are a staple of anime, man. <laughs> Up ahead is Mosui Town. That will be our base of operations for the duration of the trip. Mosui Town. Mrs. Briar, I don't feel so good. Oh, <laughs> that reminds me, Mr. Stack, I don't feel good. Don't disappear, kid! Uh-oh. All that travel must have given you a dose of motion sickness, hmm? 
why don't we pause here for a moment and take the sight of these fields? Now, Comet, have a little request for I have a little request for you. Could you run ahead to the community center in Mosri and let the caretaker know we're here? It would also be great if you could explain that uh, one of our students is feeling unwell. I can do that. I'm on it. Let's go. I knew I'd be able to count on you. On your way then. I look after your poor travel buddy here. Can we move around the map now? No, I think not yet. We're going to have a limited... Um... Oh man, this is so good. It looks different. Also, I feel like... The, the color palette is different. Look at Janma. A Puchiena Janma. I don't remember the spider, the spider name, but it evolves in Ariados. I really like the spider, by the way. It's very cute. What is that? Oh, a bug. Don't come at me. <laughs> this is really cute. And by the way, this Pokemon should be able to... Um, should be very high level as well. I think it begins at level 50 as minimum. Not very really sure. Let me collect all of this stuff though. Bulldoze, two potions, which is gonna be nice. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the um, town and call for assistance. Uh, so that I can be free to travel around the map because now we are just over here So let's go over there and call for assistance that way we're gonna be able to travel around the map A mass outbreak of Janmo. Oh, that's gonna be really good. Oh look. It's there. Oh Yeah, little, little buddy <laughs> it's so cute! I was just looking at it, walking. Should I capture it? Let's go. Can I? <gasps> I can! Coridon Oricalcan Pulse. This might be my starter for this. It's a male as well. Um, let me try a quick ball. Actually, Yangma. The problem is that if I hit it, it might die. What? Yeah, <laughs> if I hit it, it might die. Let me try. Uh, with a l Let me try just one throw. Please stay there. One. No. Oh, this thing is strong. I think even with Drain Punch, which is not a... Oh, never mind. It is a very powerful attack. I'm kind of fucked right here. Let's try Drain Punch. Hopefully, I don't kill it, but. Yeah. <laughs> Coridon is too strong. I, I didn't know that we could capture Pokemon this early, though. No, Yangmo. I'll come back with you, little one. Uh, I'll come back for you. But first off, let's go into the town so that we can ask for help. Then we're gonna be free to capture all of these Pokemons. Look at that. See, look, there, there's one now. What is this? Hello. Why, well, hello there. So, you're one of those students who came from the Paldea region, huh? Wow, way cool. Hush, Kiran. I'm Carmine. Carmine? Sorry, but I can't just let an outsider like you wander into Mosui town. Mosui? Mosui? I wonder how it's pronounced. 
If you insist on coming in, you'll have to battle me first. But I wanted you. Come on, sis, you just want a battle? Making this big fuss over nothing? I told you to hush, Kiki. Just ignore my little brother. Kieran. Kieran. Oh, man. All right, let's do this. Get in position. Oh, boy. Oh, girl. Both of you do not know what it's coming for you. Is it going to be 1v2? I only have one Pokemon. I'm going to have some real good fun f with you. Oh, the eyes are cool. I'm taking a screenshot of that. You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Carmine. Are you kidding me? It makes sense, though. Welcome to Kitakami. For your first experience, get ready to eat dirt, bitch! <laughs> you know what? I ain't doing this. Fuck you! Ho! Okay, no. Oh, you know about type matchups, huh? Why so aggressive, man? I'm just here to have fun! And learn. Sent out Vulpix. Mm, Dragon Clash should do the work. Hopefully, it doesn't have plain body. That would be annoying. I'm starting to see that the level is around level 56, 55, something like that. Polchageist! Oh, that's cool! Polchageist is quite a nice Pokemon. I might get it. Well, I, I already have a few, but I would like to. Wait, no, I think Watcher Geist is exclusive to Violet, no? No! Who? You? Who are you? I am the champion of Paldea, baby! Huh? Wowzers! <laughs> I'm screenshotting this. You went and beat my sis? I can't believe it! There's no way you should have been able to beat me! Fine, I guess you pass. Barely, but you did. Seems I've got no choice. I'll let you into the town, but only if you become one of my grunts and do every, th every little thing I... Oi! What are you doing? Causing uh, a ruckus out there. Tch, here comes trouble. Come, Kiki, we're out of here. But, but I... Wait up, sis! Wowzers. <laughs> Why, hello there, stranger. You must be one of the students from that Poldian Academy, right? I help run the community center here in Mosu Town, and a fair few other things besides. I'll be looking after your group during your visit. I hope those two kids weren't giving you any grief just now, were they? Nah. I wonder why they're so mad, though. I hardly know what to do with the two of them, especially that Carmine, always been a handful, a handful that one. I apologize if she gave you a hard time. It's all good, man. What's that? A member of your group fell ill down by the bus stop? Oh no! I better get over there and give them a hand so they can make it into town. I'll take care of everything. You go ahead and get yourself settled in at the community center. We'll catch with, uh, we'll catch up with you soon. So can I explore now, or do I still? Uh, let me get into the community center. This way, this way, everyone. Oh, here they are. Look. Comet, I owe you one for fetching the caretaker. Our little travel body is feeling much better now too. Alright everyone, this is the community center. This is where you'll be staying while you're here in Kitakami. 
The plan was to have you and the students from Blueberry Academy stay here together. But it turns out this space is going to be all for you, our visitors from Naranja Academy. Oh right, those two kids were originally from this town, weren't they? So in you wait. So in you come, don't be shy. I'm very excited for this man. There's so many cool Pokemons. Come on everyone, pack right in. Oh no need to worry about your shoes or anything. You can leave them on in here. If they're extra dirty, just try to rinse off the worst of the mud using the washing station by the door. Nice and clean inside, don't you think? It's all newly built, so it's as good as anything you'd find in one of your big fancy cities. This, e this here is the lounge. You can watch TV chat or relax however you like and well let's see over there is the cafeteria and toilets will be down that way when you want to go uh, to get some sleep please use the rooms down the hall there we've got enough space that each of you can have a private room for yourself that's nice so i think that about covers everything but if you run into trouble at all don't you hesitate to talk to our fine staff at the desk. Thank you for your tools, sir. Alright, kids. Do you have anything to say to the staff who will be uh, taking such good care of us? Um, thanks for having us. Yes. What a bunch of well-mannered students. I can already tell you're going to be wonderful visitors. So you think of this place uh, as your own home away from home and relax. You must all be tired after such a long day. I know it's a bit early still, but why don't we have dinner then Kai tonight? We got plenty of food ready for you all, so I hope you brought your appetites. Alright! Oh man, now I'm hungry in real life. <laughs> It's Christmas! We have to celebrate and eat well! I'm happy! Thanks for the dinner! You're free to spend the rest of the evening as you like in the community center. But remember that tomorrow the, pro the program will officially kick, uh, be kicking off. Don't stay up too late or you might oversleep. Ooh! And now we are free? Get some rest in your room in the back. Press the L button while the map app is open to switch between different maps. Ooh. Flying taxis will take you to any location with a feather mark. Even if your destination is in another region. So now we can fast travel between different maps. And look, there's the Yangmo. Yangmo, I think it's called. Yangmo or something like that. I want to go and try to get that one. It's going to be cool. And this is the region. Oh, this is pretty massive. Look at that. How much is it? Probably a third or a fourth? It's like the entire sector from this point all the way to the coordinate right here. So maybe a fourth. That's a pretty big map. Because Paldea is massive. This is cool. I like this a lot. Now, can I heal my Pokemons? Welcome, dear student Paldea. We provide special service to visitors here at the Kitakami Community Center. If you opened your bag and whatnot while you've been here, you might have noticed that the theme of the upper and lower borders of your screen in some menus now changed, depending on your location. Do you want to change the settings for the upper and lower borders on your menu? Send them back. Uh, leave them as they are. This is cool. Okay. I hope you enjoy your sightseeing around Kentakami with your current settings. So now, if I see my which things, my options, it has. It should now say 
Which options? Boxes? So it says apparently that... Ah, the bag! Ah, look! It has now the Kitakami uh, logo and thingies. That's so cool! Yo, that's really cool. Let me save before anything. Okay, now what I want to just see has anything to say. No, leave them as they are. So, can I go out and explore? No, so let's go and rest. And let the next day begin. Ah, look! Here we are, all the students, and I think they are part of the program as well. Morning, everyone! Did you sleep well? Starting today, you'll be joined by our two students from Blueberry Academy. I know they, they, they are from the other academy. Um, so basically, you have the um, Naranja Academy, which is the one from the main region, Paldea. Then you have Blueberry Academy, which is from the indigo disc and then you have the kitakami um center right here that is where you are gonna do your field trip so this is cool go on kids time to introduce yourself hi i am carmine it's a pleasure to meet you to meet all you outsiders i mean visitors from paldea <laughs> or he <laughs> i'm kiran Kylian Mbappé, let's go! Wait, no, it's Kieran. Kieran. Kieran? Kieran? Carmine and Kieran actually grew up here, so ask them for help if you need anything. And you two had better be of real help, you hear me? Aye, aye. Alright. Now, that's settled. Why don't, uh, why don't I tell you all a bit about what we have planned for you. This school trip of yours will be an exercise in orienteering. <laughs> First, we'll have you split into pairs, then each pair will be tasked with finding three scene boards located around the land of Kitakami. On each scene board, sign, sign board, sorry, on each sign board, You'll find snippets of an old folk tale passed down here in Kitakami. Read all of them and learn a bit about our home. To prove you've completed the task, we ask that each pair take a snapshot together in front of the signboards with their phones or camera. Take a photo together in front of each um, of, the, of the three signboards to complete your mission. It's self-guided tour of Kitakami. Learn all about its rich history. Much more fun than sitting around and listening to me ramble on and on, eh? Wonderful! What an innovative idea for a group activity. Oh, and I've got a gift for each of you as well. Roto stick. What is that? A stick? Oh shoot! A stick to rest a rotten phone on. It allows you to take selfies from a little farther away than you could on your own. So this is like a selfie stick that allows you to extend the um, distance so that you can take pictures with you and other friends or with you and your Pokemons. This is an amazing feature, man. I love it. Look at this. Um... Press the X button while in selfie mode to use your roto sticks. The roto sticks add some extra distance between you and the camera, making it easier to take photos with your friends and Pokémon. There we go. I hear these things are all the rage and the big in the big cities. Use them with, uh, use them when you take those photos. I'll even teach you a rad pose and I came up with all on my own. Eureka emotes. Eureka emotes. Ah oh, yes, real rad. 
real rather indeed. Remember that one of the goals of this trip is to de deepen the ties between our two schools. It seems like having someone who knows the area well would be a big help. That being said, let's try to maximize the number of inter-school pairs, okay? Time to mingle! They're watching me. Now look at me. So that's it. Talk to the kids from the other schools. Wait, can I just... No, not yet. I need to make friends. No, my worst enemy. Well, hello there. You're coming or whatever, right? Let me guess. You want to pair up with one of us? Poor, lonely, blueberry students. Yes. Gosh, it's so sweet of you to go out of your way like that. What would we ever do without you? Bro, that's so sarcastic. Oh yeah, so my little brother here has been all googly-eyed over you since yesterday. We wouldn't stop talking about you even at home. I seriously couldn't get him to shut up. S sis, what are you telling him that for, dummy? Hey, watch who you call dummy if you know what's good for you. Oh man. Look at him being all shy. See, my brother's no good at talking to people. He'd probably never work up the nerve to ask you uh, to ask you himself. But he'd really like a battle with you. Okay. Well, what do you know? Turns out you're sorta of nice. This'll make my brother real happy. Chin up, Kiki! Comet says he'll battle you. What? Wowzers, really? You don't mind? He doesn't mind a bit. Get to your positions, you two. Everybody else, clear out. Make some space. I've got this. I wanna capture Pokemon's I just have a Korean and she's very OP. This is a perfect IV, perfect EV's Coridon, by the way. This is a Uber tier Coridon at the moment. It's not max level though, so there's that. Centred? Wowzers, I can't believe this. I get to battle you? This is awesome! The sunlight don't hash. What level is Centred? 59 Yeah, so we really are gonna be one-shotting everything until I can't go and, and get some Pokemons Sent out Janma Bro Oh, that's it. Let's go. At least it wasn't six Pokemons. Holy shit. Wowzers. Good show. Nicely done, kids. Nothing like a friendly battle to get to know someone. Wowzers. You sure are strong, Comet. Yeah, this kid looks nice. You really aren't half bad, Kiki's nearly as strong as I am, you know? I don't know about that. This orienteering thing, we're supposed to group up in Paris, right? You should go ahead and pair up with Kiki then. What? No, sis, don't. Don't what? It's not like we can pair up. Or were you hoping to partner with some other rando? <laughs> rando outsider instead of comment? Well, no, but... Oh, man... It blows. Don't worry, he's just been shy. I'll go find some chump to pair up with uh, too. Watch out for my little brother, you. So I made a new friend. I like Kiran. Kiran? Kiran. Kieran. I don't know how it's pronounced, man. Looks like you've, pa you've all paired up. 
Let's go ahead and mark where you'll be going on those rotten phones of yours. Now then, off you go! Do some exploring! I am free! Kylian Mbappé is my partner in the Pokemon Adventure. Let's go. Oh, and if you find yourself in need of any potions or Pokeballs or the like, head on over that way, over that way, and stop by Peaches. They'd be happy to set you uh, to rights. Um, so it looks like we should probably start with the signboard at Loyalty Plaza. That's our past... No, that's out past the Apple Orchards on the west side of the village. Is it Orchards or Orchards? Not fully really sure how it's pronounced. It's close by. And I figure it might mm, make sense to, you know, visit them all in order. I'll probably just get in your way if I stick too close. So I'll just follow you from a safe distance. Man, no. And it's okay. You're with me. We're friends. No. Where are you going, bro? You're my friend. Friend. Stick together. This is Clavel. Do I have the pleasure of speaking with Master Comet? Yes. Hi, Director Clayball. My, my, it certainly does this old heart good to be greeted with such a lively response. Now, if I could take a bottom moment of your time, there is something we must discuss, Com Master Comment. You're about to be presented with an exceptional opportunity. Oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. This is a bit of a problem, because this is how the Indigo Disc begins. Uh, but, yeah, let's continue. You already know of the Unova's region's Blueberry Academy, I presume? Of course. Indeed, tales of your school trip to Kitakami with the Blueberry Court reached even my office. In any case, the director of Blueberry Academy happens to be an old friend of mine, and he told me that he would be delighted to host you as an exchange student at his school. I believe it will be a fine chance for a, a fine chance for you to learn even more about the world. One should always take advantage of new challenges like this, don't you think? Though I must confess, I was a bit surprised that Blueberry's director would specify by your name. Still, I think it's best that you meet the man at least once you find what he might be thinking. He is admittedly a bit of a character, but not to worry. I'll be there with you when you meet him. Once you feel ready to respond to his offer, I ask that you come by my office so we can discuss the specifics together. Ah, don't feel free to prioritize your... Wait. Do feel free to prioritize your ongoing school trip. Though, if you so wish. If you so wish. This student exchange matter can wait a little while. Now... I won't take up any more of your time. Do take care until we speak again. Oh, this is cool, actually. This is really, really cool. Because now I have the, the little announcement for the Indigo Disc, which is you're going to go to the Blueberry Academy. Um, but beforehand... We need to stay right here in Kitakami and complete the story because, uh, like uh, Clavel said, it's very important for the future as this connects certain storylines. So uh, let's continue our adventure right here in Kitakami and let's see what we can do. But for now, um, I'm going to end the episode just right here because we have access to the entire region of Kitakami now and I'm very excited for this because there's so many cool Pokemons, especially that Yanmo. I want to get that. Um, oh, wait. There's a seven stars. Wait, 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 wait. Does this mean that we get the seven star raid? Sorry, a six star raid on every region? Yes, there is one right here, one uh, six-star raid right here. 
there is another one on Kitakami, and there might be a third one on the Indigo Disc on the Blueberry Academy later on. Oh, that's fantastic! Um, but we are gonna leave this for another episode. For now, thank you so much, and welcome to the Kitakami land. Let me see something. Now, off you go. Let's do some exploring. I am so excited for this. Let me save the game. And on the next episode, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to go and capture some Kitakami resident Pokemons. But for now, thank you so much for sticking with me. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Comet. And now I see you tomorrow with more Pokemon Scarlet and Violet the Teal Mask. Have a Merry Christmas, everyone. Peace.